2016-2017 season. Uh, we're here with Ethan Cunning. Uh, we're, we're starting off the coach's corner off right. I'm going to be coming at you once a week, maybe once every other week. Uh, starting this week with some pretty basic technique, um, nothing too complicated, just to get the season started off right and to get our drilling started off right. So we're going we're gonna to be talking about double legs and uh, the proper steps to them. Now, the number one thing I see wrong with our double legs currently is that our knee hits the ground before uh, we penetrate into our opponent. So when Ethan dressing me, he's going to be in a good uh, Franken Frankenstein stance, a good drill partner, uh, square stance, if you will. Um, and I'm just going to be coming in and hitting a, hitting a basic penetration step, but I want to focus on my shoulder hitting his gut before my knee hits the ground. Okay. So what I don't want to see when we take our shot, I don't want to penetrate knee hits, then shoulder hits. Okay, that's bad. What I want to focus in is a big penetration step and our shoulder hits that gut. Okay, as you can see, I penetrated through my guy before my knee has even hit the mat. So back step, front step, there's my penetration. My hands are shooting through. Now when I drop to that knee, there, here comes my, my real penetration. Boom. Okay. Now, now I'm in on a good attack and I can, I can finish this nine times out of 10, okay? So when we're drilling, okay, focus on shoulder hitting the gut first, then our knee hitting the mat. So good motion, whether I'm from an inside tie, whatever your setup is, I take my penetration, shoulder hits gut, hands shoot through, and I'm driving in, okay? Second thing I want to talk about is how we're finishing. So, we got a good setup, okay, good hard snap. I penetrate in, boom, I come running down, and now I'm ready to finish, all right? The, the key here, what I say, is claw and shelf, okay? So when I get to my feet, always get to my feet to finish, and I'm gonna run this guy down, run, run, run. When I get to here, as you can see, this is my shelf. I'm putting his legs on top of my knee, shelfing them off. What this is going to do, it's going to control his hips. Okay, the higher level in wrestling you get, you'll get guys that can scramble out of anything. But if we can control his hips, we can control the man. Okay, so when I finish, I want to lift these legs, shelf them up. Okay, there's my shelf. I like to reach behind my knee. Most guys are going to turn into us. That's when I come up for my claw, looking for back points. So that's how we should finish our takedowns or our double legs. Any power, any power takedown we do, we should finish with a claw and shelf. Okay, so I'm in here. Okay, good movement, good stance. All right, partner's in his breaking stance, stance for me. That's a good drill partner. He kind of wrestles it back. Okay, good hard head snap. Shoulder hits belly, knee hits ground. I get to my feet and run. I shelf. He turns into me. Turn in. I claw. I finish. And that should be where we finish right here every time. That's going to secure our takedown, secure our wrestler, and possibly get us back. If we can get back points against a good guy, we can probably win. One more time. Okay. Good partner, square stance on me, let me drill. Move this guy around, good head snap. When I go to penetrate, my shoulder's got to hit his gut first. Boom. I drive in, get to my feet, run, run, run. There's my shelf. I like to hook behind. Partner turns in. Here's my claw. Finish up high. There's our back points. Okay. So again, we got Ethan Cunning with us. Uh, seventh grader having a great middle school year for us. Uh, five and up? Six. Six and oh right now. Okay. Killing the season. Uh, one week into club right now, a couple weeks into uh, middle school wrestling, and high school starts next week. So really excited time right now. Um, let's get out there, let's work, and let's have, uh, let's have some good, good hard wrestling this year. Go Lions.